five. And thanks for joining us on a Tuesday. I'm Tim Seaman. And I'm Bridget Bennett. As the school year comes to an end and students prepare to head to summer break, two longtime Siouxland teachers are preparing for a more permanent break in retirement. That's our top story today at 5. KCAU 9 reporter Marina Bach is live at Morningside Elementary School after spending the afternoon talking to both women about their bittersweet chapter in this long and productive career. Marina? Two teachers here at the Sioux City Community School Public School District shared with me today that they have continued to evolve their lesson plans to keep up with the dramatically changing times. But one thing that has stayed persistent for both of these women is their love and passion for teaching. Then I goes, hey, you did a great job with the expression. So much easier than before. We didn't have computers. Everything we did was go somewhere, find a book that had teaching things in it that you could use. So it's made it so much easier and so much more fun for the kids. Cindy Bennett has been a teacher in the Sioux City Community School District for 40 years. You figured it out. Good job. Susan Jordan has spent 35 years in the classroom. Both women say times have changed, but they have enjoyed changing with them. The students have one-in-one -one access to the computers and they're able to do a lot more of um, their writing and reading all on the computer, which was never like that when I first started teaching. Bennett and Jordan both knew at a very young age that teaching was their calling in life. Now Bennett is passing that passion along to her children. But it's, Leeds has been a great place to work and my own children, my three children went to Leeds and they went through Sioux City Schools and now my two daughters are teachers and one teaches at North and the other one teaches here, so I have a feeling the Bennett name won't be forgotten at Leeds. <laughs> she has a wealth of knowledge that goes way farther than technology, so it's very bittersweet that she's leaving. Um, it's been great having her in my classroom and in the building, and I know everyone at this building is going to be so sad when she leaves. Okay, don't forget, you've got to read this sentence carefully. How would that make sense? For Jordan, the love of teaching is a way of life spanning three generations. Even though I'm telling one part of my career goodbye. I hope to come back and make a difference in the world of education, maybe someday subbing in my daughter's classroom because she is now going to be a teacher and I would like to help her in her classroom. Both Bennett and Jordan shared with me today that retirement does not necessarily mean the end. Both women plan to continue to come back to Sioux City Public School and continue on substitute teaching for their co-workers. Live in Sioux City, Marina Bach, KCAU 9 News. All right, Marina, thanks for that personal story this afternoon.